It's a collage posh birdhouse. So we're gonna make this cute little birdhouse um, and cover it with a bunch of hand painted papers, some Xerox papers, um, or, or actually uh, photocopies of my original artwork and some painted paper towels. I'm gonna take a little bit of uh, my collage posh and apply it to the surface. Um, and you just work sections at a time. I'm using a foam brush. And just make sure you get every single part in there. Um, you can cut the paper, um, you can tear it, it's totally up to you. I usually cut pieces. Um, so I'm not trying to make it perfect, I just want to kind of patchwork this on here. And um, I can always cut the pieces off later. So it's probably good to use a thin type of paper when you're doing this because it's much easier to fold it in the little creases. And since I didn't have enough of that one little piece, I'm going to put another piece of painted paper on here. So you can use anything, scraps of napkins, um, crepe paper, painted paper. This is paper that I've um, painted with acrylic paints. And it has a, it's a newsprint type of paper. That's the first part of it. So for the roof, I've decided I'm gonna just cut some strips of my painted papers first. This is a dyed paper towel, painted paper towel. This is what scraps are great for. All the little bits and pieces. And we cut off of here. These are photocopies of my original drawings. And now we're gonna take all these fun little strips that I cut and start using these. Um, and I'm actually gonna put a little bit of glue on the corners of the roof too, the edges, so I can just take this and fold it over. And then I, I'm gonna trim it after. So, put one strip and a little bit of collage posh and wrap. You can actually wrap this part underneath. There we go. Put another something contrasting right next to it. So I'm just overlapping just a little bit. More collage posh. Yeah. So the strips don't have to be perfectly cut. I actually think I'm going to cut a couple of them skinnier. So I just keep adding as I go. Corner. And there we go, we got one side done.
thing is a uh, to seal it is one final layer of collage podge. So take a small brush and a little bit of paint and just brush it on the edges. And you could do that for that this bottom part of the, the roof too if you didn't cover it with paper. But it's a nice way to finish off. You can choose whatever color. Depending on the color, you may need a couple of coats of paint. And then right in the corners of the base here, just to cover all of the wood. One last swipe of paint down there. And there's our fun little collage podge birdhouse. Stripes on the roof, a little bit on the back. Very fun. <laughs>